Hello, it's me, not the Annie. I'm doing another challenge for her, but this time I'm adding a little twist. I'm putting a little note in there, letting her know what she can use in this palette. Her palette this time, Dream State. All lovely glitters. Let's see what she does. I know which three colors are going to be off of this. She doesn't. See you later. Hi guys, it's Anne. Yes, I'm doing it again. I let the gem pick a palette. Or a combination of palettes. We'll never know until I open the box. Anyway, there's the glasses out of the way and the box let's see what kind of he, he he thinks oh here's a challenge for you these three top to bottom left to right use every third color yes there will be hating going on Top to bottom, left to right, every third color. Alrighty. Well, this is going to get interesting. On account of Bad Habit Dream State. is all glitter every bit of it so left to right one two three first one would be surreal One, two, three is abstract. One, two, three, blur. No, Nirvana. Nirvana. One, two, three, bliss. And then, last one is Origin. This is going to be interesting. Yes, that's the word. Interesting. Yes, darling, I will kill you later. That's okay. <laughs> Oh, he's over here laughing now. Mr. Giggle. He's got his headset on so he can play his game, but he heard me well enough. Now he's giggling. Giggling. Oh dear. I gotta get some more cleansing tissues. Better known as makeup wipes. This is the Next to the last one. So, let's see. How am I going to do this? Hmm. Interesting colors. It's going to be the problem of trying to figure out exactly how I'm going to put them. Yes, I curled my hair, and yes, I went ahead and took the pins out earlier. So I'm going to put a pin back in to get the front out of the way. And yes, I've had my cut touched up a bit. So, there we go. 
Alrighty. Now, I am not going to start with spraying any of this. Origin is the darkest color. I'm getting ahead of myself. Got to put a little eye primer on. I've done all the rest of this stuff, you know, the sweat goo and the moisturize. But I've got to put my eye primer on. Otherwise, I've got nothing to use for a base under all this and I want the colors to at least stick even though if I'm not even though I'm not really trying to get the shimmer shimmer to be really standing out in all of it so yeah I'm going to be putting it on mostly dry Use one of my little sponges here. Get this blended out just a bit. <laughs> yeah, that's the beigey shadow primer that I have. That's the beigey one. Uh, we st you can probably still hear some of the traffic noise. We're on just off the main street. And we don't really have an air conditioner in this part of the house, which is our bedroom. But part of the reason for that is because we need a swamp cooler as opposed to a regular, a, 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 what most people consider a standard air conditioner because we're in a really low humidity area so sucking humidity out of the air really doesn't cool things down because there's not really enough to do that heat exchange thing so we actually need to add some humidity to the air so that when the low humidity sucks it out of the air it does the heat exchange at this point though we're still not at a temperature right now that's causing that much trouble for either one of us as long as we keep the sun exposure down in the room and have the windows open we get a nice little breeze we're up against the up against the edge of the mountains at the edge of the high desert so we're not in that bad a shape when it comes to staying cool. Okay. 
Okay, this is Nirvana. This is the next lightest shade. Since my husband, being a smarty pants, decided to leave me a challenge, I'm going to extend the challenge just a tiny bit. All of you out there who's got a Seago, who's not necessarily directly involved in your filmmaking and your creation stuff, let them pick your stuff. Give them a category. I make him stick to my eyeshadow mostly. I haven't let him loose on anything else. But eyeshadow is where I really like the challenge. So, get your Seago, ask him to pick. You can either, like when I first started doing this, I let him pick, but he didn't get to do things like this little challenge letter. He came up with that one himself this time. But, me being me, why not? You know? Yes, I'm using my little color switch in between because the origin is a brown with gold shimmer in it, but it's a really deep chocolate brown. And then the Nirvana is more of a green. There's a lot of green in the glitter. So it, it's a really deep olive. And then with a touch of lighter glitter going on. Yeah. I'm going to use abstract. This is where it's going to start getting a little more interesting. Because abstract is into the purples. I am barely touching this palette with the brushes and I am getting a fair amount of pigment just by barely touching so Bad Habit is one of my favorite kind of quote-unquote off-brand makeups. Unfortunately, it's getting hard to find because Shop Hush, when they had it, it kind of went 
when Shop Hush went on her. Which I really cried about, in a way, sort of. There wasn't a lot of boo-hooing, but I was really unhappy that I lost that resource for getting makeup in my price range that was kind of nifty. Bad Habit had interesting things. Shop Hush carried them. Yes, one eye always ends up looking lighter than the other one, at least to me. So I'm dipping back into those first colors again. And then abstract again. Now, Abstract has got a lot of gold glitter, but it's a purple and gold. Now I'm going to pick up some of the bliss, which is that pink. And I mean, this is pink. Okay? Pink. And I'm going to try dabbing it in the center here. I may have to wet this one a little to get it to show up. Either that, or I'm going to use it as the brow highlight. And I'm going to put a little under here. I'm going to put that under there anyway, because I think it's pretty. Yeah, I'm broke out still. Yes, just like a couple other people I know who do beauty content, I wipe off the ferrule on my brush when I've gotten the ferrule damp because I don't want extra fluid 
running down into the palette and wrecking my pigments. I also don't want any extra fluid running down into the ferrule and loosening up the glue on my bristles. I just, I'm not having it. may put some pink pencil up in my eyebrows this time instead of the brown just because okay take that off and I'm gonna pick up surreal which is the last color which is that really pretty sour apple green. Now, I've gotten this far, I'm going to go off camera, finish this up, probably look for some earrings that'll work, and some other jewelry and such. I'll be back. Alrighty, everybody, I hope you're ready for this because here we are. No, I don't have a shirt right now that's proper for this, but uh, I pulled out my jewelry and I'm really wishing we had a nightclub near here. We're a good two, three hours away from the closest nightclubs. Anyway. All glitter gold metallic eyeliner even put the falsies on these are the largest longest falsies I own elf Bordeaux on the lips face candy Mermaid Glow Palette Siren on the cheeks and around the eyes I believe I may have met the challenge now that leaves the rest of you Let your seagull pick your stuff out. Go for it. It's only makeup. It'll wash off if you don't like it. And if they decide they don't like it after you do it, you know exactly what to do to them. Wait till they're sleeping. <laughs> after all, they if they picked it, it's their own fault. I still have to get used to wearing eyelashes this long. They're, I don't, I'm not normally able to wear them because I have glasses. And long eyelashes really don't work well. I'm hoping to have sometime this year some new contacts. In the meantime, 
yes, I got out the rhinestones. I need a good drag show to go to. Anybody know of one near here? I'm out in the boonies in Oregon. Anyway, tell me what you think. If you decide to go for the challenge, tag me. I want to know. I want to see what everybody else has done. Yep, I'm looking at my monitor to see what it's looking like on film so far. Be good.